por el Licey. Patazo de Odile Elevado que está buscando atrás el patrullero derecho. Sigue atrás, se metió en la pista. Ante seguridad. Ah. All right, we're going to talk about O'Neill Cruz. This guy is from the Pirate. Uh, Pirate. Uh, Pittsburgh. From Pittsburgh. The Pirates. Ooh, Pirates. And he's playing for, for Dominican League right now for the team called Licey. This kid just connect his first home run in this league. And let's check what he got on his mechanics, okay? What we're gonna do, I'm gonna see it and I'm gonna tell you about it, all right? So right here, as you can see, right there, he got a great load, great coil, you always do. He always do, he always coil good in his back leg, really smooth. Now the ball start getting released, start getting released from the hand. He start moving forward. And look at that separation, man. Front shoulder down when that front foot start touching the ground and the ball still in the air, his heel still in the air. So normally when the heel's in the air, that tell me that he's not ready to pull the trigger yet. But when the ball get closer, then you see the heel going down. Now, great separation. You can see his number, his jersey number from back here, from the camera. So that tell me that he separates that lower body from the upper body really well. And then after that, look at that. He start getting on posture. And look at this. When he start turning, look at the back leg. You can see the back hip up and up. So that tell me that he creating that stretch from his core and then his torso start turning. And then from there, shoulder tilt. Look at outside pitch, people. Outside pitch, and he hit that home run over left center. No, right center. He hit that home run over right center. So a lot of people like to go pull, I mean, push the ball the other way because the ball is all the way. No, he keep his swing, allow him to barrel the ball hard no matter what. And he hit the ball the other way when normally people think outside pitch, we need to pull it, we need to push that ball the other way. No, we just, he just, he just keep his swing and he just, called pull the ball. He just, he don't even literally pull the ball. He just keep his swing the right way, the, the way he's supposed to do. And that he barrel the ball hard and then end up being a home run. Now let's just see see this from this side of, uh, uh, from this angle, from the side. Great coil. Look at how he coil around his back leg really good. Right there you can see. Then when he start going forward, his front shoulder start working down and the knob start getting to the catcher, so allow him to develop some coil in the wrist kind of in the wrist kind of kind of way, so he can develop some power when he going forward. And then after that, he trying to work back in the back leg. He don't move forward when he start turning. That's another thing. So if he go keep going forward, normally it's hard to keep the bat in the right angle. But right there, he stay back, and the barrel barrel start working behind. But he was early with his swing. And he almost hit it with one hand. That's a crazy stuff. Because the power that this kid developed before he hit the ball is so good and so powerful. Like the stretch that he developed right here. Look at right here. So when the lower body go forward and upper body get back, he's developed so much stretch the right way. They allow him to be fast with the hands and allow that barrel work through the song or through the song of the ball or through the pat pitch pattern that allow him to barrel the ball hard no matter where he hit it, he hit it early, early outside, he still, the power the barrel developed behind is so hard that he still, he can pull it and still have the, the, the great results that he have right there as a home run. Great kid, he's young, he's very athletic. I can see the athletic ability by the stretch that he has. And if he keep working, he's gonna be one of the best ones out there. He got very athletic ability and, and the mechanics look great for, as a young kid, okay? So hopefully he get these mechanics and, and, and get better at it. But he's gonna be the guy that we're gonna talk later on. Great stuff out there. I hope you like this. Uh, subscribe if you don't. And we're gonna keep putting knowledge and more games and everything else. If you want to know about your mechanics, go to CastroBrosCB.com or go to CastroBros Instagram and you can subscribe and we put in drills to create this kind of separation because this is what I do. I do this video analysis because I want to show y'all what is the right way so we can work on that.
okay? Not just because it's the, no, because we want to work on this to get like the elite levels, elite players that got elite things in their swing. And we need to copy that so we can be like them or be better than them, okay? So I hope you like it, subscribe, and see you next one.